Sepsis is caused by an uncontrolled spread of infectious pathogens and release of toxins that can lead to systemic inflammation, multi-organ failure, or even death. Worldwide, 18 million cases of sepsis are reported each year, and one in three septic patients ultimately die from complications. The infectious agents that cause sepsis are often never identified, and so patients are routinely treated by being administered broad-spectrum antibiotics. But dead pathogens can still release debris and toxins that trigger systemic inflammation and organ injury. Now, researchers at the Wies Institute have developed a new pathogen extracting device that can remove live and dead pathogens from circulating blood without ever needing to know their identity. Blood flows out of a patient and through hollow fibers similar to those used in dialysis machines. The inner walls of the fibers are coated with an engineered capture protein that binds to and removes all classes of pathogens, as well as release toxins. Clean blood is then returned to the patient. This blood cleansing approach leverages the pathogen binding functions of a natural blood protein called mannose binding lectane, or MBL. MBL binds to many different types of bacteria, fungi, viruses, parasites, and toxins. It has been engineered at the Wies Institute to prevent unwanted inflammatory reactions, to simplify its purification, and to enable its attachment to the inner surface of the hollow fiber. Because this new pathogen extracting therapy does not require a physician to first identify the infectious agent, it offers a way to treat patients earlier. And because the therapy removes inflammatory debris released by killed pathogens, as well as living microbes, it synergizes with conventional antibiotic therapies. Based on the positive results obtained so far, this therapy is now moving to large animal testing.